RPG Unmaker, because everyone needs f***ed up feedback. Remember FDIC, void with prohibited. <laughs>
we have just come to the edge of the world. Can I jump off the edge of the world? No, I can't jump off the edge of the world. It's the edge of the world. I don't want to commit suicide. Dude, Carter, choose life, man. Don't commit suicide by jumping off the edge of the world. What the hell's wrong with you? But seriously, this is literally the edge of the world. Look at this. There's like no... There's no... This, is this like a floating continent? I, I mean, what the... What the blue hell is going on here? Did we just like step off into a, par a time paradox or the sky of nothing or are there like bandits that are like flying and gonna come flying out of this edge of the world? They're just gonna come climbing up the rocks and what what the heck is going on? What is this? RPG Boy random music reset? No, but seriously, um, no, I got your name right. Correction to this guy's name, it's Kings of RPG. That's Kings, like, more than one, so I don't know if there's more than one of these people making this game, or if it's just one guy with multiple personalities, or, you know, uh, playing this game would give you multiple personalities, schizophrenic disorder, you look at this menu and you immediately get every mental disability known to mankind. I mean, look at it. So we have come to what is apparently the second town in the game. And this town appears to be just as empty as the first town was. And uh, over here we have a blacksmith with uh, nobody inside. Oh, there's somebody. Okay, whose house looks like this? I mean, what? Well, this looks sort of like some sort of a crafting system. Uh, obviously, I don't have any of the items that can be used for it yet. Uh, what do you do? Blacksmithing is not supported in the demo. Well, you are just as useful as useful can be. Why are you even here? Why didn't they just, you know, couldn't he have just made you disappear for the majority of the demo and, like, closed off the entrance to the blacksmith shop and just said, we're closed right now. Alright, let's head to the weapons and armor shop. Maybe we can get some upgrades for our... Dude, you know, this is more empty than the other shop was. I mean... Why, 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 why? See, now this is what you should have had in the first town. You know, you actually get an option to buy some stuff that's not... Just shoes. So let's buy some weapons, if we can. Uh, steel sword is worse than what he has. Steel axe, we just got one of those. I don't... Iron blade. Iron blade is even worse than what he has. Wait. Yeah. But he already has an iron blade. So how is an iron blade worse than an iron blade? Dude, does that mean your crap is low quality? This is a low quality weapon shop we got here. Iron great axe, ace bow. Oak bow is the same, a powerful bow with medium range, a powerful bow with long range. Okay, so I guess if you want to lose, but it's the same power. but she can't use it. Oh, okay, so that must mean we're going to be getting a new character soon. So, why don't we wait until we have our new character before we buy more stuff? That makes sense, doesn't it? I thought so. And you are a pirate, or possibly a British conquistador of some... Wait, no, the conquistadors were Spanish. What the hell is wrong with me? But you're some sort of a British military official. Looked like you were ripped out of Pirates of the Caribbean or something. You look like you should have Elizabeth Swan like stored off in a secret room over here. Uh, how are you doing, old friend? Hey, si hey, Saris, where's your capital letter? 
Did you lose it in the fireplace behind you? Great! I've come back to rejoin the battalion for some reason. Who are your friends? This is Carter and Daryl. Of course you know Aaliyah. Yales. Will they be joining our group as well? Yales. Well, Carter, you can take the furthest room to the left in our bunks. And Daryl, you can take the one next to it and you can have your old room, Brody. Well... We have another character who talks and acts just like the rest of them. Everyone just speaks in proper English with no inflections, no personality quirks. Everybody is just like the last body. Why do you do this, RPG King? Greg. <laughs> uh, soldier's blocking off the item shop from this side. That's genius. Look at this. I want you to get to the damn item shop. You gotta go all the way around. I'm gonna block it with a log and a soldier. Uh, we've got another shop with no walls. What can you buy at the item shop? HP and MP restore. It costs... Why would you ever need to restore 200 MP? You get like unlimited freaking MP. And why would you pay 300 gold, that's like a third of the price of a sword, to restore your MP when a potion only costs 50 and it restores 500 HP? That's just... That's wrong. You're wrong. Mr. Kings of RPG. It's wrong. In! Can I stay here now? Can I go to. S the hell? This is a weird looking inn. This isn't my room. 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 Well, Jesus Christ, man, dude. What? <sighs> this isn't my. This isn't my room, this isn't my room, and there you go. You are... Oh, we finally got to reset our HP, so... This is a good thing. Look, dude has a mirror. Okay, look. Look, two, two mirrors. Dude has two mirrors in this room. Okay. When are you ever... <sighs> that dude in his red jumps... I mean, his silver jumpsuit and his... Look at him, he looks like he's wearing a jumpsuit and jeans. No, it actually just looks like a regular jumpsuit. I don't know. And it's day again, because we slept. I don't know where we're supposed to go. Okay, we've learned now that black squares in the void of space-time means we're going to a different area. So at least we know that much. But let's go talk to our uh, British noble soldier. Good morning. One, one word. Good, good, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I have a kind of big job for you. What do you need? We've traced the bandits that attacked you to a camp east of here. I need you to go kill more, more. Say it with me now. Bandits. Yeah, bandits. Got it. I'll let you decide who to bring. Richard can show you the ropes on party management. We have some other new recruits that you can choose from. Richard? Richard Brody. Richard Brody. Mr. Brody's real name is Richard. Okay, Dick. Dick Brody. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. 
Dick, where are you? I need to get the lowdown on party management, my friend. This isn't my room. This isn't my room. This isn't my room.